My name is Alan DeWitt, and I have a sleep disorder. Delayed sleep phase disorder, specifically. It's the most underdiagnosed or misdiagnosed sleep disorder that exists, according to a plethora of resources online. And my problem at the moment is I have no idea on how to deal with it, specifically in looking for employment. I'm a hard worker. I've worked a number of jobs. L almost lost a few of them because of my sleep. In delayed sleep phase disorder, in short, what it is, is you are effectively eternally jet-lagged compared to the rest of society. If the rest of society says, oh, you need to wake up at 8 so you can get to your job at 9, that's fine for most people. Most people then go to bed at 10-ish, wake up around 6-ish, 7-ish, depending on how large of a breakfast they want. What the brain actually does when they do that is your brain knows you want to wake up at time X, 7. It knows that you want to get 8-ish hours of sleep. Tracks back to 11. Your brain has no idea what 7 a.m. is, has no idea what 11 p.m. is. What it does know is that 11, 10-ish, is so many hours after sunset. 3, 4, whatever it is. And your brain's like, ah, if I want to wake up here, then that means I need to fall asleep here. And that means, uh, oh, that's how far that is after sunset. Great. That's when I'll put myself to sleep. Now, that works fine for most people. And most people, if you offer them a million dollars a year next, next month, as long as they could switch to a job that was four hours earlier, they could do it. You know, it'd be hard, be painful, but they'd be able to. They'd be able to adjust their sleep cycle. I can't. Cannot. It's not an option. It's not something that I would love to do. Well, it is something I would love to do, but it's not something that I can choose to do. My internal circadian rhythm is broken. My brain has a relatively fixed time that it thinks I want to wake up and a relatively fixed time by extension that it thinks I need to fall asleep at. And for me that's unfortunately roughly 3 to 4 in the morning and roughly 11 to noon in the in the day. Every day since I was about 11, 12. How did I get to school in, in high school? My parents woke me up. How did I get to school in college? I chose later schools, it, later classes for my school. I, I woke up at later times. I worked around it. How did I hold jobs? I almost didn't. My first job out of college, uh, I almost lost because I couldn't show up at the 6.30 a.m. shift. So, thankfully, somebody in another department saw how hard of a worker I was and gave me another option. I almost lost my job after that because of me having trouble to getting into work at time. Thankfully, that's when I decided to actually look for medical help with it and was sent forward to a medical um, sleep disorder re research center and was diagnosed with delayed sleep phase disorder. I was lucky. Most people aren't. Most people bounce around between diagnoses for years before it's pecked down for them. That, however, doesn't help me where I am now. Where I am now is trying to find work. I left my last job because I couldn't work commission. It's a whole separate issue. I can't deal with it. There are lots of people who are able to do a very ethical job working commission. I did as well. I could not take the stress. That's a personal thing, separate. But it puts me in a position now. I, I sought that job out partially because I would be able to make my own hours. I've been trying to be proactive about my disorder, trying to be forward thinking about what this would all mean. And I don't know what it means going forward. I don't know how to talk to my future employers about my problems, about what my concerns are, my issues are. I don't necessarily want to start up a private individual business where I could set my own hours and work, work what I want to work because then I'm still in the day-to-day -day stress of effectively commission. Only difference is I don't have somebody from, from headquarters breathing down my neck as to what my quotas are. That's true. But I don't know what to do. I don't want to just work second shift because besides the fact that severely limits what little social life I have and 
limits my opportunities to go on dates in the future. I would also miss out on a lot of life, a lot of seeing other people I care about, my nephew, my sister, my friends. I don't know what to do. I'm not asking for help. But I can't be the only one going through this. I cannot be the only one with delayed sleep phase disorder who has these same problems. If you have my disorder or something similar to it, and you found something that helps, even just a little bit, let me know, please. Tell others. Because for the life of me, I, I don't know what to do. I'm going to keep trying. I'm down to only about a month or two of my personal savings left. But I'm going to keep trying. I hope you do too. Good luck.